Yeah, yeah. This should play up on IQ, man, and I'm back with another reaction. And yeah, this time you guessed it. We got uh, the fourth accused killer, Adolf, Jamarcus Johnson, straight drop, brother. Half brother. He appeared in court today. I don't know what the fuck happened. Let's see how it went. They was talking about revoking his bond or some shit, so we'll see how this goes. R.P. Doff. John Son. Yes, sir. Good morning, sir. Good morning, how you doing? I'm doing fine. How are you doing, sir? Since John's been indicted for the grand jury charge. That nigga asked, why the judges be so fucking crazy? Some of them, how you doing? Um, I'm in fucking court. I mean, I'm in, I'm locked up for a murder, so I'm not doing too fucking good. Um, I'm alive, I guess. Dumbass judge. In indictment 2204769 with conspiracy. You see that? He got the gang unit. Dude behind him got the gang unit jacket on. So does that mean? The felony to the first degree murder. Yes, sir. Mr. Johnson, if you are convicted, and I'm not suggesting you be convicted of anything, mm -hmm. but if you are convicted of that offense, it carries anywhere from 15 to 60 years in prison. Now, do you understand what you charge for, sir? Yes, sir. Damn. 15 to 60 fucking years. Did you see that nigga head? You see his eyes closed? That nigga eyes closed for a second, for like two seconds. He was like, oh my God. Damn, the look of shame. 15 to 60 years in prison. Right there, that nigga said, oh my God. <laughs> like the Usher song, oh my God. See kids? It doesn't pay. <laughs> Stay in school, man. <laughs> do, some, do some cool shit, be a rapper. Do, Stay out of them streets, man. Uh, do you understand what you charged for, sir? Yes, sir. Mr. Johnson, you have an attorney? Yes, sir. Who's your attorney? Josh Cor, C-O-R-A-N. Corman? Cor. C-O-R-M-A-N. Oh, he got a, a shit, he got a lawyer. He might be the nigga that got the money. <laughs> I'm just saying if it was, you know what I'm saying? They saying he was the one that took to go pick up the money, da-da-da. C-O-R-A-N. He's probably Corman. Cor. Is your family trying to harm Mr. Corman? Uh, yes, sir. I talked to Mr. Corman a few minutes ago because I was told that you thought your lawyer was somebody that talked to Mr. Corman, and he did tell me that your family has been in contact with him. They have not hired him yet. Oh, they, were supposed to meet oh, they didn't hire him yet. Damn. With him this afternoon at 1 30. Uh, your co defendant, Hernandez Dovan, is set on December 16th. Mr. Corman asked me to set your case on that same date for an arraignment setting for an attorney on December the 16th. Mm -hmm. So I will set your case on Friday, December 16th, to give your family a chance to get Mr. Corman hired. If you come back to court on December 16th, um, Mr. Johnson, if you tell me that, Judge, we are not going to be able to hire an attorney, I will appoint someone for you, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, do you want the time to get Mr. Corman hired, sir? I'll see you back in court on Friday, December 16th, and make sure you get a lawyer hired. Okay, thank you, sir. You said back in the dock. Okay. For the record, it's unrelated. It is a related matter, actually, that is not on the court's docket. Regarding. Well, shit. He didn't get his bond revoked. I didn't hear nothing about him getting his bond taken back. I mean, I don't know if that happened outside of the, the, court, uh, the court session right there, but. He still got he if he can he what ten percent of three hundred thousand he might can he might can shake free get loose and fight it from outside but either or it ain't no good fucking situation man like I always say man long lived off man it's a bunch of bullshit in the end man y'all let me know what you think like comment subscribe I'm gone.